What's going on everybody? It's Luke Brady with Bell Helmets and today I'm going to take you through the Race Star DLX. Starting with the outside construction of the helmet, we have a 3K carbon shell. We've got fully adjustable vents all the way across from the front to the back. You've got a nice chin bar vent here, one on the top and one on the rear. Moving around to the back of the helmet, you can see we've got a nice truncated rear spoiler for aerodynamics. You'll notice here we've got a Snell 2020 version. This will also be available in ECE 2205. If we move around to the front of the helmet, you're gonna notice you've got pro tint. So again, that's gonna be a photochromatic visor that's gonna to turn to dark smoke on its own during the day. So depending on how much UV is in the air, it depends on how dark it's gonna get. So it'll auto tint from clear to dark smoke. One of the other really nice features about this helmet is that it has class one optics. So what that means is that it's optically correct. So there's no visual distortion in the shield. So your eyes aren't gonna get tired. Speaking of the shield, it's super easy to change out. All you gotta do is lift the shield up, push the button, slide it forward, it'll pop right off, line it right back up, you hit snap right back in, and it's ready to go. So really easy shield change out mechanism if for any reason you wanna change it out. Okay, moving to the bottom of the helmet, you'll see that we have a really nice neck curtain as well as chin curtain to help quiet down that road noise. One of the key safety features of this helmet is gonna be our MERS system, which is our magnetic emergency release system. And what it allows us to do, if you were to get in a serious accident, we can just slide the cheek pads right out the bottom because they're ma magnetically connected to the helmet. So it makes it super simple. Also, if you wanna wash and clean your interior, it makes it real easy to clean the interior out. And one of the unique features about this helmet is we're actually gonna be using a virus material inside of it. And the nice part about the virus material is virus is a company that came up with a way to infuse the mineral jade into the fabric and it actually creates a cooling effect. So the ambient temperature of this fabric is gonna be 10 degrees cooler than a standard material. Another really nice thing is the antimicrobial and antibacterial properties of the virus fabric are all done at the molecular level, so it'll never wash out, it'll never wear out, it doesn't dissipate. Now that we have the liner removed from the helmet, let's go through what's on the inside, what really matters. So first and foremost, you'll notice here on the inside of the chin bar, you do have removable foam pieces so that you can run a communication system. So you have the option to run any communication system you want. The only thing you'll have to do is remove the foam plug that's right here. So you just pop that right out. You'll be able to drop your recessed speakers in and you're good to go on communication systems. But what makes this street helmet real unique is gonna be our flex liner system. So rather than using a traditional EPS, we're actually using three materials instead of one. EPP, expanded polypropylene, EPS, EPO expanded polyolefin and EPS expanded polystyrene. Now each one of those materials is designed to manage a specific speed of impact. So we have three different materials for slow speed, mid speed and high speed. Now there's a slip plane that's built in between the EPO and the EPP and what that allows us to do is mitigate rotational forces by allowing the pieces to rotate individually inside the helmet. So not only are we able to manage slow speed, mid speed, and high speed energies, we're also able to mitigate rotational energies. I would like to point out that there is a removable top pad in here that you can take out so you can customize the fit of the helmet. So if you need to move it a little bit higher on the forehead or lower on the forehead, you have that option with this piece. One of the other benefits of the Flex Liner system is it allows us to increase the airflow between the EPP and the EPO. So when you look inside this helmet, you can definitely see there's more gaps within the EPP and the EPO that allow us to increase the ventilation. So now that we've taken you through the inside of the helmet, as well as the outside of the helmet, if you have any other questions, go see us at bellhelmets.com.